connect this wire right here. There's a grommet. You can slide that wire, that grommet up. And if you can slide the connector through, makes it easier. Take a pick or a screwdriver, just get underneath that lock. Just slide that off just like that. Just make sure that it doesn't fall back in. Just leave this right here. Then we'll close the gate. Now we're gonna open the glass. There's a clip right here. You can just take a screwdriver and try to pop this clip off. It's just holding the wiring harness down or you can use a pick. And as long as you can get the wiring harness out, just move it out of the way. Push that clip back for now. And pull that through. Slide the harness right off this retainer right here, out of the way. Using a Phillips head screwdriver, take this screw out right here. Also over here. Double check, make sure there's no retainer right here before you slide this out. There may be a screw there. Just pry this down. And very carefully slide it out. Take the new light assembly and you wanna slide this tab in first, just like that and then rotate it up. Take the screws, get those started. Before I tighten that down, I'm gonna put the other one in. Get that lined up. And then snug it down. Not too tight, it is plastic that you're tightening down. Just now slide the wiring harness back the way the original one was around this retainer right here. Just push that in. It's just to hold it out of the way. And slide the connector underneath here. You want to force that grommet through. Just push it underneath. It will fold pretty easily. As you feed that through, you want to try to get that harness underneath that clip. It's right here. Slide that clip open. And just slide the wiring harness behind the clip and then close it. Close the glass hatch, open the regular hatch, connect the connector. like that and then you can fish that back in. If you're having trouble fishing it in you can take the weather stripping back and then pull down on the liner just slightly. Feed it through and take the grommet. Slide the grommet in place and then push back the weather strip.